72 log, entry 74. We're now moving through sector 18, area 93. We've heard of the existence of an old battleground in this area. Our mission is to check out this battleground and make sure that nothing dangerous still exists there. fast. Some scavengers are after a girl out there. Out there. Catch him on foot. Let's go get the jet jumper. For millions of years, Earth was fertile and rich. Then pollution and waste began to take their toll. Civilization fell into ruin. This is the world of the 25th century. Only a handful of scientists remain, men who have vowed to rebuild what has been destroyed. This is their achievement. Part two, a mobile storehouse of scientific knowledge manned by a highly trained crew of young people. Their mission, to bring the hope of a new future to mankind. Arc 2 log, entry number one. I, Jonah, Ruth, Samuel, and Adam are fully aware of the dangers we face as we venture into unknown, maybe even hostile areas. But we're determined to bring the promise of a new civilization to our people and our planet. See if you can see that tank. south of here. It must be where she came from. We'd better inform her people. You're right. I'm coming back.
that machine. Don't let it enter. Good morning. Take your machine and leave. All machines are forbidden here. All machines? But why? They're evil. Because of machines, because of the pollution and destruction they've caused, we now live like this. But machines are just tools. Good and bad exist in the men who use those tools. Now, if you want us to leave, we will. But we thought you might like to know that we saw a girl captured by a band of scavengers. And we thought she might be from here. Where? Near those old wrecked war machines? She couldn't be from here. Why not? Well, because we're not allowed to go near those machines. That must have been a scavenger girl you saw. Jonah, he's lying. He was there himself. I know. Well, this girl had uh, blonde hair. A girl with blonde hair? Where did you say you saw her? About a mile over that way. Well, my daughter Jewel has blonde hair, but... No, Zachary's right. She'd never go to the Valley of the Machines. Hey! She! Matt! Can you hear me? I think you have lost little Bo Peep. I know where to find her. Can we talk? So you were telling the truth. All right, come in safety. You know that we have captured your daughter, Jewel. Indeed, she is a jewel, a very valuable one. <laughs> Speak up, animal. What do you want? Four sacks of grain for your daughter's return. We can't possibly give up so much food. My people are already hungry. It is early morning. You have until midday to pay. I will meet you on Lookout Hill at that time. We'd like to help you, if you'd let us. Neither you nor your machine can help me. I will decide how to get Jewel back. Now leave us. That old man is a tough guy. <laughs> well, from his point of view, he has no real reason to trust us. Mm -hmm. Let's go find that scavenger camp and see what we can do. Yeah, huh? Not hungry. <laughs> you see, if you get hungry enough, you'll eat anything. Any sign of the road, Samuel? Not yet. Hey, wait a minute. There it is, dead ahead. Adam, we can't stop to eat now. Eat? Guess what we're having. Bananas on whole wheat bread. You genius. What's with you, Adam? Yesterday we had bananas on bread. The day before we had bananas on bread. What's for tomorrow? Bananas. No bread. Yeah. Stand by to secure the Ark. Activate.
This place gives me the creeps. I'm beginning to see why the old man doesn't like machines. You may get out of your vehicle, but do so slowly. And keep your hands up. What do you think, Skipper? I never have liked war machines, Samuel. I like them even less right now. Throw all your weapons over here. We don't carry weapons. We don't believe in them. What do you want with weapons? So I can use to rescue Jewel from the scavengers. Now, come on down from there. That cannon can't be fired. The barrel's been clogged for centuries. Well, why did you lie and say that girl wasn't from your village when she was? I didn't want her father to know that we'd been to the Valley of the Machines. I was afraid we'd be punished. Sacks of grain. We can't spare them. But I have a proposition to make. Take me instead of my daughter. You see how strong I am? Ten times stronger than her. You could sell me for ten bags of grain, where you only receive four for her. So take me in her place. Agreed. Take him. How long do you think you can keep this thing running? Not long. I have no more of the ancient fuel. I cannot find any more. Oh. We're looking for the uh, scavenger camp so we can help Jewel. You want to tell us where it is? Now, you're going home. Roman. Roman, you agreed to free her in exchange for me. Did I? I don't recall agreeing to anything. <laughs> I trusted you. Animal. Roman! Let us out of here! We're in danger! They've captured Jewel's father. I wonder how we can get him out. Samuel, we still have those chains in the rumor, right? Sure do. Okay, now you and Adam approach the camp from that side. Zachary, take this radio. Now, this is what we'll do. We'll go down here, follow this road. <laughs> now! Now we have father and daughter. Total 14 bang <laughs> Ready, Zachary? Yes. Remember, when I count to five, you both jump out. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Zachary. Zachary. Merrily down the stream. My dear Zachary, are you on my team? By thunder! <laughs> Look at those peacocks! See them! Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Quickly! 
Well, where are you? On the road, waiting for Jonah. Oh, uh, give him a message for me. What's that? Help! Over and out. Come on, Jonah. Sorry. For what? For not coming when I was supposed to. I was afraid. Listen, so was I. Yeah, but you did something about it. All I did was hide in the bushes. No, I'm a coward. It's because of me that Jewel was captured. Because of you? Yes. I took her to see my tank, and the scavengers captured her. You took my daughter to the Valley of the Machines? Listen, you and Matters are going to help now. Let me tell you something. For a coward, you're a pretty brave guy. You took on that whole bunch of scavengers. I can't thank you enough. Thank him. It was his tank that saved everyone. Yes, I know. And it's made me think that perhaps I was wrong about machines. 
And I'll bet you could find a lot of old engines out there that you could use. Yeah. Zachary, it's occurred to me that you might just be interested in taking charge of such a project. Oh, I'd love it. <laughs> Where did you find the fuel for my tank? I didn't. Ruth and I made it. Right in there. Well, why didn't you just use this machine to save us? Because I wanted to show your leader how useful that machine could be. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Arc too long. Entry 75. Man can seek out the good or the bad in anything. Machines can be used for good or bad, whichever man chooses. I believe these people will make the right choice. Thank you.